missed us, didn't y'all? It's been so long. It's been what? Come on. Like half a year, over half a year. It's been a while. It's been some heat. It's been it's some. Been we months. missed y'all too. We missed y'all too. Many, 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 many months. We missed y'all. We really did. So. We missed being with each other in front of the camera. <laughs> <laughs> we had a lot of things happen. So let's start right here. We're the Irish twins. The Irish twins. Lisa and Ronnie. And why have we been gone so long? It first it was computer. First it was a computer. We had we we did we had did like some videos and we were going to post them. And she had, she was editing and her computer acted it up and we lost the video and, and we just never recorded. We yeah. After that we were like you know what we needed a break. <laughs> yeah. Even if we didn't need a break, we had one. Well, we took one. <laughs> we took a long break and then she moved because she was staying with me. Then she uh -huh. moved. I moved out. Mm -hmm. I'm back in Stockbridge now. And um, so now we have to find a way to get together and actually make the video. So it's going to be more effort that has to be put into just to get the videos made. So, yeah, that's what happened. So what this video is about, what is this video about? This video is going to be about our relationship goals. So relationship goals. Let's just start off. I'm 41. I'm 42. I'm single. Been single my whole life. Never married. <laughs> I'm just going to say, I'm going to say never married. I haven't been single my whole life, but That's never single. married. Single. It's but, married and single. Yeah, but I'm saying it's like you haven't been in no type of relationship, no boyfriend. No well, life. obviously I've been in a relationship. That's what I mean. Like, Okay. Well, that's not what I mean. <laughs> So, but I'm recently out of a relationship. I'm recently out of a relationship, and it's uh, it's been difficult. Um, it is needed, and um, I uh, you, you, I understand what you say when you say it's been difficult, but when you say it's needed, yeah, because you know you can't be with anybody who can't truly be honest with you. But oh, you talking the breakup was the, needed? The breakup was needed. Um, as much as I didn't want the breakup, as much as I still don't want the breakup. It was needed. Yeah. It was needed. So I love me way more. Way, way more. Honestly. I love me way that more. That makes that makes sense. Yeah, so yeah, so And I And I'm good now. I'm good. Truly I'm good. Okay. And I haven't been in a relationship at all in years. Well, before my last relationship I have been in a relationship in over ten years. It hasn't been that long, but mm -hmm. it's been a while. Seven. It's almost ten. I mean, but mine was, but my mine was on purpose. I didn't want to be in a relationship before that. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, well, I guess mine is on purpose too because I haven't really actively pursued a relationship either. Mm -hmm. So, goals wise, what do you want? Not the type of person or whatever, mm -hmm. but what do you want? Do you want to be in a relationship? I want to be married, but I am afraid. Of marriage, especially in 2018. Why are you afraid of marriage? The reason why I'm afraid of marriage is because so many people change. <clears throat> no, 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 no. Everybody changes. Everybody changes. But in those changes, people don't hold to their word the way. They move and shake with their changes and they don't. I'm no, afraid I'm that me and a man will make a pact with each other and then he'll change his mind. And I, I'm afraid that um, my goals and my end game is not his goals and his end game, even if that's what he tells me to get me in a relationship with him. I mean, there's two, there's, I'm going to say it wrong. Um, I don't know the scripture in the Bible, but it says to, to be a friend, you must show yourself friendly. It also says uh, in Corinthians, Second Corinthians, where you, to to um, to show faith, you have to sh prove yourself faithful, mm -hmm. and um, <clears throat> that's the same in a relationship. Like if if I'm gonna have faith in you, if I'm gonna trust you on both sides, you have to be faithful, and I have, I have to, be to be faithful. faithful. And I just feel like. Why I'm willing to compromise and meet someone halfway, I think somebody might 
take advantage of that and I will always be the one compromising and I will always be the one going the extra mile for someone else and that they won't they may start off doing that for me but then in the end well Valicia is just going to take it because she don't want to get a divorce Valicia is just going to do this because she doesn't want to get a divorce and I don't want to be in a relationship where somebody's taking advantage of me <clears throat> um I mean that could be two ways but to to actually get into a relationship you have to get over that fear unfortunately that's true that's true that's something that I that's a fear that I will have to face head on and I will have to share that and be honest and transparent with a person to to be in a relationship <clears throat> so relationship goals for me relationship goals for me is uh, are <laughs> I want friendship I want commitment that would lead to marriage. Yeah. Um and uh and I think it's obtainable. I don't I'm not afraid of it all, at all. I've never been afraid to go out there and meet and date and do all that stuff. I've never been afraid to do that. Um <laughs> it's to find the same the person that that you mesh with that wants the same thing as you. That's the hard part. Yeah, and I and I also think that because I have three boys, that that is a obstacle for me. I don't think that it's is one that's not that I don't think that obstacle is insurmountable, but I think that it is an obstacle. And trust, <clears throat> if you are a man that does not want to be with a woman that has children. I'm a woman that don't want to be with you because <laughs> I want to be with somebody who's going to love me and love my children like all of us are he is. I think that I think that that person is just not for you and that, you know, I right. even worry I about, have a problem with my it. thing is I wouldn't even worry about the, the, the men who don't want to be with a woman with kids. That's not that's not your demographic. <clears throat> no, it's not my de and I'm just putting that out there. Yeah. That that is not my demographic. So I don't even and I don't have a problem with it. I don't even think that way. I think that whatever's gonna come my way is gonna be the person that I want that wants to be with me for what I want. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Like when I meet a guy and everything, if he wants kids, then yeah. He not the one for you. He's not my demographic. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, and and for me, like if a guy wants some more children. Her baby factory is closed now. I'm 42. I'm not having no more babies. Yeah, it ain't closed. <laughs> it still can happen. I closed it. How you closed it? You got a history right No, I still got all the work in parts. I'm just saying, you, it could happen. <laughs> <Don't>, <laughs> it ain't closed. She don't want it to happen. You just don't want any kids. She'll take precautions to where that's it won't different. happen. <laughs> <laughs> that's different. Um, but yeah, that's relationship goals for me. Relationship goals for me is somebody that I can be with, mesh with, have fun with, communicate with. Um, we do, we do things together and we want to do things together, you know, not where I'm in my own space and he's in his own space. Well, I'm going to have my own space, y'all. I'm going to live by myself until I'm married. <laughs> I'm going to have my own space. Um, but still you still got to be able to come together and everything so relationship goals that's what i want relationship goals mm -hmm. but you know i think in my last relationship i think we had a lot of that i think we had a lot of yeah. that mm -hmm. um but we had something going on that i didn't know about <laughs> <laughs> and, and i don't truly think he could ever be honest about it um and in the interim make me feel like I'm the one who just didn't trust him enough, and that wasn't it. So, um, see, and that, that right there, that's one of my issues. But y'all, it just some guys out there are just not willing to, and some women, true, and some true, women. But because we're women, <clears throat> we're gonna talk about the guys. <laughs> I just can't keep this stuff one sided because I can't when I because I meet men and I, every time I meet a man they always say well women this and women that and women this and women I'm like well men do it too but but I mean they're, and I they're speaking that, from their and I understand that and I understand that women, that men do it and mm -hmm. that women do it but yeah. just know that there are women out there who aren't ready there's men out there who aren't ready they might be in their fifties and they still not ready 
There's women out there who still want to go out there and, and play around. There's men out there who still want to go out there and play around. And it doesn't matter age um, or anything. Now, I will say this when it comes for me, I, I like a man my age. <laughs> I don't want him too much older, and I sure don't want him too much younger. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Um, no. Mm -mm. I do want someone my age, and I want someone who has the same belief system as me. And someone who is who's traditional, traditional because I'm traditional, and and there are a lot of people in 2018 who are not that traditional. Yeah, they want you. They want. They want to. Well, you know, <laughs> I'm not pulling out your chair. I'm not holding the door. I'm not opening the door right. for you. I'm right. not a uh, gentleman. Yeah. A gentleman. Cause why you can't ask me? Oh, why are you not paying? And I've always, I've always presented myself as a lady. And if I'm going to present myself as a lady, I'm going to present this lady to a gentleman. That's just the way I feel about it. Yeah. Um, I think a lot of things now are just straight out of order. Um, and it's crazy because we want, we want things to be in order. We want things as women. I'm going on women now. We want things to be in order when we want them in order, but then we want to be out of order and expect things to be. No, right. it don't work that way. No, it, don't, it, it doesn't. doesn't work that way. Doesn't. I don't know if that made any sense, but it just don't work that way. <laughs> and and believe me, trust. I'm. I, there are some things that I would have to work on within myself or to give up of the way I've been living to be in that type of relationship. But I am willing to do that when yeah. the time comes. I think there's. I, I know the reason why I was out of a relationship for a long time because there's a lot of things I knew I had to work out within me. And I didn't want to bring that into a relationship. And so that's what I did. Right. That's what I right. did. Um, and I got myself together. I did a lot of things to work out of me. Not, not saying that I still, I'm still not a work in progress because that's a daily struggle. Mm -hmm. That's a daily struggle. Um, but I'm a lot better. <laughs> I know... Um... Uh, I had a conversation with a couple of people and the question was presented, um, why don't women want to submit? And my whole thing is a man who's walking in his purpose, <clears throat> the woman that's going to be his helpmate, help me is going to have to submit because he's walking in her, his purpose and she's going to have to hold that purpose up. And if if she doesn't, if she can't get up under his purpose, then he's gonna leave her. I can't think of the guy's name. He's a he's a a comedian, a, a Christian comedian, but he's also I think he's a pastor now. Um I forget his name. He's a big a, a black guy. But he was I'm not gonna say how he said it, but I remember <laughs> one part was like he said a man has to has to lay the foundation and the woman grow builds it from there. Mm -hmm. A man plants the seed. And the woman has the baby. Right. You know, right. Yeah. You know th that's how it is. A man, he lays the foundation. He gives everything. And then we come, we nurture it. And we bring, a man, he, he goes and he gives and he, and he puts the house there. But the woman makes the house a home. Right, right. So my whole thing is, I love that when he said that. <laughs> my, whole, my whole thing is, is that if, that man out there that is looking for his wife needs to come find his favor. Because <laughs> I'm his favor. <laughs> yeah, but we also, but he has to find his favor. But we, we have to, I'm not saying before, but we have to make ourselves available. Oh, well, I'm still working on that part. <laughs> we have to make ourselves available. That's I'm, why I'm saying that. I know it. I'm still working on the availability Because he ain't going to find me in the room. <laughs> Y'all. <laughs> I understand. <laughs> I understand, but... Ruby's in the vault. Diamond's in the vault. I'm in the vault right now. <laughs> I am. They don't even know the vault is there. <laughs> now, shoot, the vault has to be available. <laughs> the vault is available. You just got to have the right key. I don't know. But we're not going to make this video crazy long. <laughs> and we're just saying we're happy to be back. We're going to make a couple more videos today. Um, so y'all can get uh, some more of that uh Valicia and Veronique flavor. Oh, Ronnie and Lisa. <laughs> <laughs> Valicia, Ronnie, Ronnie and Lisa, the Irish twins. The Irish twins. <laughs> so, thank you so much for 
just watching our video when you watch the video if you watch the video you know yes. it's what it is thank you for liking and subscribing and sharing our videos with your friends if you still there <laughs> <laughs> i haven't even looked we have that many anyway okay <laughs> but it's for us <laughs> And also, if you would like to follow us, hit that little red button so you will know when our videos post. And you know what? You ain't got to hit it, but if but if it'd be good if you do. <laughs> I don't even, you know what I'm saying? I'm just here. There's no charge. Yeah, I'm just here to uh, live my truth. And, and be who I am. And, and let that be that. So, uh, we have a saying that we say at the end, and I'm trying to remember it. Um, you guys, thank you for watching and we'll see you in the next video.